New York City's surge of violence has elected officials looking at changes to policing and also various laws. Experts in stopping violence applaud some of the initiatives, but say getting to the root of the problem means we must focus on helping kids. CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports. School dismissal and these New York City kids maneuver around crime scene tape from yet another shooting. They deal with violent crime and its aftermath as adults struggle to solve a worsening problem here in the city and nationwide. According to the nonprofit research group Gun Violence Archive, in 2020 in the U.S., more than 5,100 kids under the age of 18 were shot. That's about 1,000 more than any year since 2014. Cure violence experts say with shootings among teens on the rise, this is the obvious place to start. Our public schools, because we know violence begins there. Aisha Seku is CEO and founder of Street Corner Resources. At her Harlem headquarters, she guides a team of 40, many of them young adults, who fan out in the neighborhoods, gather intel, and work to interrupt disagreements before they explode into injury and death. When the gun shows up on a young kid, that kid is reeking with fear. I know that when you see the kid at 13 with a gun, if we don't deal with that at that point, we're going to see that kid again. Either we're going to see him in a box, in the morgue, or we're going to see him in cuffs. She wants to see more school counselors and similar types of counselors in more places. I don't care if they at every COVID site, every corner store, every laundromat, and relieve some of the trauma and stress that they're having. She says she supports Mayor Adams' recently announced blueprint to end gun violence, but wants a greater emphasis on beat officers who know the people and surroundings. Seku demands cure violence groups be better funded and included in more city hall discussions, adding voices to guard against over-policing and encourage more gun buybacks, more youth centers and enhanced recreation programs. In agreement is Victor Dempsey, leader of Gangs Coalition. The gang stands for grassroots advocates for neighborhood groups and solutions. From the time they're born, they're underinvested in. We're talking about from the school system all the way up to getting the jobs. They say when initiatives are inclusive, sweeping and sustained and focus on youth, New York City becomes safer. Dave Carlin, CBS 2 News.